Hi, my name is Stephen McGee and I'm the author of Curing Electromagnetic Hypersensitivity. I'm going to talk about the subject of electromagnetic hypersensitivity and that is stray voltage exposure. And we've got two very interesting multimeters that are logging our values for stray voltage. I'm going to start with this one on the left and this yellow lead coming out of it goes out through the window and out there is the temperature probe. So this one is actually measuring air temperature. And the reason why we have the TechPower TP4000ZC measuring temperature is because in my area in Tucson, Arizona, the stray voltage follows temperature in air conditioning season. So this has a computer interface, it's an RS232. Uh, it comes out, it goes through a converter which enables me to plug it in to my Windows PC. And if we click on the tech power window, we can see that we have the same value as the meter. It's actually logging, so you can see all these values here of temperature going into a spreadsheet. So that's the tech power meter. It's very, very useful for logging temperature into your PC. And this is the Uni T61D. And this one is a true RMS multimeter that is actually measuring the voltage on the electrical grounding system of the home sockets. So down here we have a 500 ohm low resistor between the red and black probe. And on the right side we actually have the electrical grounding system. On the left side is a non-electrified ground rod in my back garden that we're measuring as a reference. As you can see we currently have 0.666 volts AC on the electrical grounding system right now. And they say anything over 0.5 is a biological hazard. It's been very extensively researched for decades in the dairy industry because it makes dairy farmers, their families, and their animals very sick. So this is how the meters arrive. They arrive in these boxes. So this is what the Uni-T looks like. So this was the Uni T UT61D. And this was the box that our tech power meter arrived in. And I want to show you the logging screen for the UT61D. So this is the program. Let me click on it and bring it to the front. So you can see that it has Quite a simple display, it gives you a graph and you can set this little box to give you a pass or fail setting. But this is what is the interesting part. This is the spreadsheet values that you generate using this program. And once you've got your spreadsheet values, you can put them in to a spreadsheet program and start plotting graphs and you get some very interesting graphs. I just want to show you the interface on the Uni T61D. It's actually here on the back, it's an optical interface. And again, we have it going into a USB converter cable for the RS232 on the left. It converts across to the USB on the right. And with those two meters, you'll have a nice little setup for doing stray voltage measurements during air conditioning or heating season and you'll be surprised at how much the stray voltage follows the heating electrical heating loads and the electrical air conditioning loads so that's how i measure stray voltage hope you enjoyed the presentation and i wish you the very best of health thank you